welcome to my video. Thanks for stopping by. Please make sure to drop a like and subscribe. And please remember, this is not financial advice. This video is for information and education only. What's going on traders? Today we're going over EOLS and the stock ticker. Okay, we'll go ahead and start by drawing our support and resistance. We got our resistance right here. We got our support right here. And our median about right there. And I also notice that we have a triangle pattern playing out. So go ahead and draw that in there real quick. Okay, so if you got a long bias for this stock, you're looking to go long, what you're gonna wanna see is first of all, you're gonna wanna see the moving average just continue to rise with you, okay. But mainly, what you're going to see right off the bat is you're going to want to see a break above this resistance here and out of this triangle here. So you're going to want to see this, a break like that. And for me personally, I want to see it come down just slightly. It could be quick. You know, this could happen within a minute or two minutes or so. Um, but what I'm looking for is I want to see this come back and then that's when I'm going to hop in for the long and you know get out somewhere up here so the move I'm looking for is the break out of this resistance out of this triangle this moving average is so far down here right now that I wouldn't worry about that right now as long as you're above it which you're way above it already right here so it's not really a big deal um, so yes, again, you're going to want to see a break above this triangle, above this resistance. You want to see it slightly come down. It might be quick. You want to see a green candle close, a red candle close, and then you want to see a green candle close. And that's when you get in, or that's when I personally would get in. So that's what I'm looking for. because I want to see that continuation. Okay, I guess that's what I'm working with. So hopefully you understand that. And if you're looking for a short, you want to go short, then obviously you don't want to see it break above here. You want to see it continue to break below this median. And you want to see a break below out of this triangle. And most likely what you'll see if it doesn't just completely collapse is it, it will come back to retest and then that's where you'll see if there's weakness or not because if it breaks right back through you know there's still strength but if it starts to droop down and draw wicks then you know the continuation is most likely at least down back to, the, to this level and then you just continue that scenario if it, sometimes it'll gain strength and continue back up but if it doesn't if it breaks through if it happens to break through, what I do is look for it to come back up or at least close. And it'll probably try to make one last push back up because this is a, you know, this resistance. So it's going to, or is this is support, previous support. So it's going to try to create new resistance. And then you ride it back down that way. So you get that continuation confirmation, right? And, um, you know, obviously you'll want to think about the moving average. You want it, it's probably going to make some move like this, um, and then start to turn back around with you, but you'll see as it'll, it'll break through. And that's why this short might not be the best, but this short, once it breaks below this support and then comes back up creates resistance that's the best short for sure so 
All right, if this video helped you traders, then please hit that like and subscribe button. I try to do these videos as much as possible every day. Thank you, have a wonderful day. Thank you.